Hi, I'm Rainbow Hollingsworth. Here are some of the day's top stories. Richmond police are investigating a deadly shooting in the Wickham Court neighborhood. Officials have confirmed that they were called to the 2300 block of Ambrose Road shortly after 8 last night and found the man who had been shot. They took him to a nearby hospital with life threatening injuries and he later died from his wounds at the hospital. As Major Crimes Unit continues to investigate, you can help officials out if you know anything about the shooting. Contact Crime Stoppers at number 780-1000. Chesterfield police say a Manchester High School teacher has been charged with assaulting a student. They tell us that back on January 19th, they received a report that 49-year-old Freddie Williams had struck an underage male student at the school on Bailey Bridge Road the day before. Monday, after further investigation, police say they obtained a warrant for assault for Williams. This is a developing story and we'll bring you updates on air and online as we learn more. All right, Tom. All right, thanks a lot, Reva. We've got a chilly, breezy day today, but as we go through the hour by hour forecast, we're dry, lots of sun, just going to be a bit on the cool side. Tonight, clear and cold will drop to the mid 20s. Tomorrow, lots of sun again, just around 50, and then we'll start to see more clouds. This is Thursday, especially by Thursday afternoon as some warmer air settles in. 49, breezy, cool sunshine today, and then overnight tonight, clear and cold will drop back into the mid 20s, which means some outlying areas could see some lower 20s tonight night and here's a look at your seven day forecast 50 tomorrow 56 Thursday more clouds arrive and just a few spotty showers maybe into Friday warmer for the weekend a lot of clouds though could be some showers around after Monday it looks like that frontal boundary causing that rain is going to bring some colder temperatures then for next week so it's not a permanent warm-up but we do get a couple of good days there in the 60s from CBS 6 the weather authority have a great day